What's up guys, welcome, it's Ryan from Game Tech Review and welcome to my Foot Champs and Division Rival Rewards. Before we get into my rewards, we are going to first of all talk about, uh, where is it? Oh, it doesn't show, how oh, great. Uh, the Pitch Notes article that was released uh, by ES Sports with regard to the first owner objectives. Uh, let me see if it will appear again. So if you log into Foot, uh, I don't know if it'll appear for me. No, it doesn't. Yep, uh, it appeared before. Uh, the they have released a pitch notes article about first player objectives, first owner objectives, and I feel it's a it just screams cash grab all over it, just like how it did for the uh, moments icon uh, promo. It just feels like cash grab because right now you are going to be forced to either take untradeable rewards in division rivals, which I am not going to be doing. Uh, or you have to, if you take credible rewards, you're going to have to hold on to players uh, and hope that uh, those objectives come that you can use your players. Like, let's say if they ask you to field a full first level League 1 squad, you're going to have to hold on to League 1 players hoping that they get given an objective like that. Because if they give an objective and you don't have those players, then you're doomed because you have to now wait and hope until you pack a full League 1 squad and even then the league one squad you pack might not be as good which means and if it's a, a division rivals win objective you're screwed uh you go into division rivals with at a disadvantage uh so i feel it's a, it just screams cash grab because you know either get the first owner players from packing them or from doing sbcs and sbcs means doing s uh doing overpriced sbcs like theo walcott martinez these guys are just overpriced SBCs in my opinion and that's the only way you're going to get first player objectives and this is they're going to tie it in with the foot swap icons which means a lot of people have to now think alright do I have to take untradeable rewards which means you're losing out on potential coins uh, that you could be making by taking tradable rewards uh, or if you take tradable rewards are you going to have to oh shit now I packed a player now I can't sell him because I'm going to have to hold on to him uh, and hope that the objective comes. Like if you pack a Dembele, you probably won't sell your Dembele because you'll be like, oh, what if they give me a La Liga or a French objective to do, or even a Barcelona objective, and I need a first owner player. So you're most likely not going to be able to uh, take, uh, you're most likely going to be taken to untradeable because of that, and you're just going to be stalling your uh, uh, terms of growing your squad and all. That's what I feel. I feel it's a money grab, complete money grab. Because if you don't have the time to put into this game, you're going to end up having to spend FIFA points just to be able to hope and pray that you get a good card that is usable in uh, competitions like Rivals and Champs. And if they put, I don't think they're stupid enough to put objectives in Champs, but you never know. This is EA. But to be, you need to, if they'll definitely put objectives in Rivals, and you're going to have to have good cards to be able to compete. Because otherwise, let me tell you, you're going into this competition, into rivals with a weaker team, because like they had this, where was this? Wasn't this? They had, if I remember correctly, you guys would know. There was the uh, what was it? It was the Oktoberfest objective where you had to score with a headed goal, a headed goal with the first owner German player. The only guy I got was Hummels and. It was tradable, so I sold him because the reward was just a kit. But imagine you want to try and get something like that. You have to wait. Let's say if it's scoring a couple goals with like a first own German player, you got to wait until you either pack a Timo Werner, Marco Royce, a Havertz, someone pretty decent who has good shooting in front of goal to be able to even think about completing. If it's like score a goal and you have to win the game as well, like about 10 to 15 of that, that's just crazy. I just feel like it's basically a mug, cash grab. It's just a full on cash grab um, for me. Anyways, saying that, let's get into uh, Rivals Rewards 58. I don't know what rank I finished on. I think this is rank two. I don't think I made rank one. Uh, let me just check. Because I had about 24,000 points, so I'm not sure. Oh, 58,000 is rank one. Is it? Oh, okay, so we are rank 1. We managed to make rank 1 of Division 5. So it's pretty good. 
Now, saying that, I am not going to go with untradeables because it's two rare players, two mega, two four jumper premium gold, but I'm going to be taking the tradables because my pack luck in general is pretty shit. Uh, so because of that, I'm going to be taking tradable anyway. Because it's, me taking untradables is just I'm not going to be able to get coins, uh, and I'd rather get like player value uh, instead of having to take like these packs untradables. I tried untradables in FIFA 19, and I did mainly untradables because you had icon SBCs and you could have you can collect cards like 83s, 84s, and you can slowly slowly collect and put them into icon SBCs. But like now you don't even have icon species. You're gonna have icon swaps. So there's for me I don't see the point in holding on to so many untradables, which is why I'm gonna take the tradable. <sighs> Having bashed here now, I'm definitely going to get shit rewards, uh shit packs, but that's can't help it. Rank one, division five, let's get positive. Let's open it. Foot champs is ready. Alright, so we'll first open the uh untradables sorry the under the tradables i also have a pack which is untradable i feel it's this one this one was from the season objective so let's first open our packs division rivals and then let's get into the food champs rewards uh we're looking to see if we can pack any good cards but my packs are generally not that great to be honest it's pretty bad usually so i'm not expecting anything big so let's go Jama Premium Gold Pack, first pack from the Division Rival Rewards. Yeah, not surprised. Oh, Inaki Williams. That is pretty good. That's a good start. Even for like a non board, Inaki Williams is right now. How much is it? Naki Williams is 20k. Oh my gosh. Lads, this is why you take the tradables. I can hold on to this Inaki and wait and see what Friday's objectives are. But like, that is a brilliant start, I'll tell you guys. Because I can definitely now feel like selling him. One loan, loan pack. Okay, there's the. Now, if I need a first owner, I have a loan pack. Uh, so, Inaki Williams, good start. Uh, let's see how it goes. It can only possibly go downhill from here. Uh, but anyways, this is one of two videos that I'm going to upload. The second video is going to be about the player of the month uh, for Premier League, which is possibly out tomorrow. So I will have a video on that as well. This I don't think is that great. Yeah, Masuaku, not that great. Uh, so there will be a player of the month video that will be out tomorrow. So, to, not out tomorrow. It will be out like a couple hours after this possibly because I need to get you guys prepared for it. So definitely, definitely don't miss out. You don't want to miss out. All right, let's send all of this to the club. Premium gold players back. This is an untradable. This is most likely from the, uh, this is definitely from the season objective. I think this is definitely untradable as well. No boards, man. But like, am I surprised? It was only going to go downhill from Inaki Williams, guys. Because that is how my pack luck is. And that is why I'm telling you guys, I usually don't take untradables. Are these both untradable? Wow, great. And that is definitely why I should tell you guys, I don't do it. There is no reason for me to take untradables when my packs are usually pretty bad. Alright. Mega back, let's see what we can. Oh, walk out. That's good. I don't know what that is. Spurs, don't go. Adiwa. Adiwa. Another good, another good card, another good card. I will take it. Very slow though, but I will definitely take it. He is SBC for that. And tomorrow's Premier League player of the month, he is going to be definitely useful. Uh, 30k right now, he is definitely going to rise even further. So we have made. 50k from two players so far that 50k is going to rise even further uh pro probably or oh, tell us i can keep this tell us and sell the tell us i have probably because this tell us will now be first owner for me and i already have a tell us in the club and the tell us i have has a shadow on it 
So this is about six nine, but that's all right. That's pretty good. I'll definitely take that. That's good. That was a really good pack. Uh, so we've definitely made at least about seventy k so far. Uh, that's definitely we're sure about. Rare player pack. Come on, man. Be something decent. Oh, this doesn't seem like. Oh, this is a walkout as well. Who is that? Striker. Oh, oh Get in, man. Get in. Get in. What a pack. Let's go. Let's freaking go, man. What a pack. First owner as well. Now, tradable rewards, guys. Tradable rewards. It's lit. Oh my gosh. I am telling you, Guys. Dude, this is crazy. Let's go, man. Let's freaking go. Yo, that 360 almost. First owner. Holy shit, man. That's my biggest pack pull yet. Oh my gosh. Gosh. <laughs> this is why you take a trade of us, guys. Because you get packs like this that you can sell eventually. Oh, man. I'm over the moon. Crazy rewards. Crazy. Oh, that was so good. Two walkers in a row. What is this? Is this a Batangan again? Or Aldovalga again? <laughs> it's Batangan. We have the Aldovalga and Batangan combination, guys. Oh, this is good. This is good. That was crazy. That was crazy. I made... For... About 450? Because he's three. Yeah, I, I would... If I sell everything technically, I made about 450k. Alright, Marvel rewards were insane, which means foot champs cannot be insane. There is no way foot champs is insane, guys. I'm telling you. Anyway, goal three, foot champs rewards. Let's go. Two mega packs, two rare player packs, and two player picks. Team of the week isn't that great, but that's alright. Let's see what our first player pick is. Alright. We, oh, this is, a, this is a pretty good card. 89 pace, what league is he? Oh, he's in the Mexican league, damn. This is actually a pretty decent card, not gonna lie. That is a very bad card, not gonna lie. This is an actual pretty decent card. With a Sentinel, that's a pretty decent card, I'm telling you. He's Mexican also. Oh. How tall is he? Five foot ten. Oh. Mm. I'm taking him. Because it looks a decent card. Uh Dunk is not usable at all in gameplay. If I want to use some card at least, I got him. So I'm taking him. Uh, we're definitely taking him. Sane, two star, two star. Definitely not. No, thank you. Like, no. So we're taking Rodriguez. That's a pretty decent card. I'm definitely taking that. Uh, let's go with the second one. Ah, <laughs> ah. The curse of not getting good foot champs rewards continues, boys. It does continue. Six foot three, high low. Oh, 
Alright, get them defaults in. In terms of reds, for goal 3, that was shit. Because I didn't get a single starting level. That was pretty bad. <laughs> but I told you guys, rivals are pretty good. There's no way that uh, chance has been anyway good. Alright, two megas and a wrap. Two megas and a wrap, yeah. Two megas and a wrap, let's see. Come on. This is not a walkout. Ooh, Ricardo Pereira. That's a good card. How much is he? How much is he? Woof. 16k. Woof. Yo. I've made about 500k. Oh, another loan pack. See, why do you need to take untradables when EA just keeps on giving you loan packs? Oh, so good. All right, mega pack again. Let's go. Not a workout, definitely. Ah, oh. damn. It's all right, it's all right. It is all right. That's all right, boys. Oh, 75, 80 rated. Be something decent. Who is usable? Probably this guy, right? Three-star wake foot, four high medium, that's all right. Four-star skills, left footer. Uh, decent shooting, can't do much else though. Well, Ruben Dias. Ooh, four star big foot. Didn't know. No pace though. I'm going to go with Iago Falke because it could be top five leagues for like first corner. Can't say anyway. Uh, anyways, let's go. Did we get anyone decent? Nope. Uh, I'll do. Alright, the last pack, rare player pack, and then that, no, that will be a video tomorrow, not tomorrow, sorry, after this, like a couple, couple hours after this, uh, for you guys, I don't know who that is, screen there, probably screen there, yeah, for you guys, uh, on player of the month, so definitely keep an eye out for that, I'll take that as well, first order. Uh, Alright, final pack. Let's go. Let's see what we can get. Come on. Walk out. Dutch. Cam. PSV. Bergwin. Get in. Let's go, man. Alright, let's see how much he is. That's definitely. Good one. Swing that bad boy. 58k. I have made at least 550 minimum. 550 to 600k from rewards. That's possibly, or that's definitely my best ever rewards for FIFA 20. Uh, possibly one of my best ever since like FIFA 19 as well. And Tarich and Belarabi. That's pretty good. I'll take that. Belarabi definitely. That's this was a successful rewards. This was a successful reward show. Uh, I'm definitely happy. Let's just finally have a look at like what we packed in terms of like decently pretty good. Uh, let's just let's sort it. Let's sort it to value higher low. Alright. So what do we pack? We pack Bertrand <sighs> Upper man Oh my gosh Adwell uh, We did Pachateles A tradable one Keep that in mind And a Tadic Inaki Williams uh, Did I pack Adwell just now? No I don't remember 
Ricardo Pereira, Pereira B, who's pretty decent, I would say. So all on, I am very happy with our pack close. Uh, definitely hit a like in the comments if you guys want good pack luck, and stay hit that subscribe button if you guys want to get ready for player of the month. Uh, for Premier League tomorrow, it'll it'll be out on Friday probably. That's what we're expecting. Uh, so I'll definitely have a video later on today. So definitely hit the like button for that, and I will see you guys in another video later. Peace.